Committee today, the latest major turn in the investigation into Russian interference in last fall's election. Chief Intelligence Correspondent Catherine Harridge has details. With restricted media access, this is the only photo of Donald Trump Jr. at the closed-door interview with senators and staffers. In a prepared statement, the president's son said, I did not collude with any foreign government and do not know of anyone who did. On the June 2016 Trump Tower meeting with Jared Kushner and then-campaign chairman Paul Manafort, Trump Jr. said it was set up after a tip from a longtime entertainment fixer, Rob Goldstone, who claimed the Russians had damaging information about Hillary Clinton. I thought I should listen to what Rob and his colleagues had to say. To the extent they had information concerning the fitness, character, or qualifications of a presidential candidate, I had no advanced knowledge of who would attend. A reference to the Russian lawyer Natalia Veselnitskaya, her translator, and a Russian businessman. There is no basis right now to conclude whether there was collusion or not, or whether there was obstruction of justice or not. And that is the remaining area of the investigation that needs to be fully explored. Fox News has learned that special counsel Robert Mueller wants to question White House staffers with knowledge of Donald Trump Jr.'s initial response to the meeting. While on Air Force One, sources say President Trump and his aides discussed the preliminary statement. At that point, the president thought the meeting pertained to adoptions. In a separate development, a senior Republican on the Senate Judiciary Committee said fired FBI Director James Comey should testify again on the Clinton email case. After FBI records show he drafted a statement that exonerated her two months before Clinton's FBI interview. I want to inform the public as much as possible because this doesn't add up and I smell a rat here. In a statement late today, Donald Trump Jr. said the session went five hours. He answered every question about the June 2016 Trump Tower meeting and other topics until both sides had exhausted their lines of questioning. And he trusts his interview will fully satisfy the committee, Brett. Catherine Harris, live on the Hill. Catherine, thank you. You're